I'm Ian from Intellinet Network Solutions, your end-to-end -end networking solutions leader. Today I'd like to introduce you to our line of industrial PoE networking switches. Industrial switches, or sometimes referred to as hardened or rugged switches, are made for more extreme types of environments, generally because of the temperatures they can handle, as opposed to any type of commercial or indoor switches. Industrial switches can withstand temperatures from minus 40 degrees all the way up to 167 degrees Fahrenheit. Industrial switches with their IP40 slim style housings are also used in NEMA boxes outdoors for cameras, traffic lights, and many other outdoor applications where temperature might be much higher or much colder. Industrial switches are also used in warehouses or manufacturing plants because of super protective dust proof ratings that keep the ports protected. Majority of the industrial switches in the market today have a terminal block input that will power the switch with anywhere from 24 volt up to 57 volt input depending on the switch itself and the power supply used. All of Intellinet's industrial options for PoE that you see here have two redundant DC inputs that are great fail safes, 44 to 57 volts. These switches are perfect team with our Meanwell power supplies in 120 watt and 240 watt options. Today, we are going to show you our options of managed and unmanaged industrial PoE switches, starting with our 508254. This is our unmanaged four port industrial switch with 120 watt power budget. This switch allows up to 30 watts per port PoE plus across four ports when using 120 watt power supply and gives you two SFP uplinks to go to any other DVR, NVR, or any other uplink that you need to go to like another switch. Our next step up is our eight port industrial PoE plus unmanaged 508261. This has the ability to have a 240 watt PoE power budget across eight ports when using a 240 watt power supply, yet still supplying a full 30 watts per port and having your two SFP uplinks. Both of these options are perfect for outdoor access points, security camera applications, and many other applications out there. If you wanna manage your network or have the ability to cloud control your network with Domote's cloud control, then our 508278 industrial managed eight port PoE plus switch could be the switch of choice. Same features as the unmanaged eight port with a 240 watt power budget and two SFP uplinks, but this switch can be controlled via the GUI when logged into the switch or control your entire network remotely with Domotes cloud control that is built into the switch. This only requires a Domotes box and the service and you'll be up and running anything attached to that network completely remotely from anywhere in the world. Next up is our new unmanaged four port PoE++ switch. This has a 240 watt power budget and two SFP uplinks. What is unique about this model is it because it's 802.3 BT compliant, you have an output of up to 95 watts per port on the first two ports and still have almost 30 watts on the last two ports. These 95 watt output ports are perfect for those higher wattage demanding devices like PTZ cameras with heater blower elements or night vision, as well as PoE lighting, LED displays, VoIP phones, intercoms, and high performance access points. This gives you diversity in the field if you only have one or two of your devices that require that much power. Last but not least is a very unique switch to Intelnet for industrial models. This is an industrial PoE powered eight port gigabit switch with PoE pass through. Why is this one so unique, you might ask? Well, the first reason is the switch can be powered three different ways with PoE injection, terminal block from the power supply or DC input with a DC power pack. The second and biggest feature of the switch is that it can accept up to 95 watts from a PoE switch or a PoE injector that can do 95 watts, like this 561495. This leaves you with a 90 watt power budget to use across the other seven ports to go to other devices down the line up to an additional 328 feet with power and data at gigabit speeds. So essentially you're getting total of 656 feet from the original injector to up to seven devices by using this 95 watt injector from Intellinet. This is a great switch regardless if you need industrial or not, as it can be used both ways and still has the higher and lower temperature ratings. This is an absolute game changer for installers as it makes their lives easier depending on their install application and how far they need to go to the endpoint devices. For more information on switches like this and all of our industrial PoE options and how Intellinet can make your life easier, please visit IntelliNetSolutions.com or contact your sales representative.